What is going on, YouTube? This is Arctic Fox. Welcome back to the channel. Today is a little different as far as this video goes. It's a little bit of breaking news out of my neck of the woods. Um, the body of an Arkansas judge, 48-year-old Jeremiah T. Buker, was found at the bottom of a lake 70 miles east of Little Rock, Arkansas, yesterday morning after local authorities had been searching uh, during a search that lasted most of the previous night. Uh, the 48-year-old Arkansas County Northern District Judge had planned on spending the weekend with his family and friends, according to the Jefferson County Sheriff's Office. He left the group on Saturday to go exploring on his own and never return. So his family and friends told police and they tried searching for him themselves, but there was no success since the sun had already begun setting in. The sheriff's office said a team of deputies were dispatched out just before midnight, and they responded to the call immediately, coordinating with the wildlife officers and the Arkansas Game and Fish Commission. The county's Marine Patrol Unit carried out what the sheriff's office said was an extensive ground and water search for the judge, whose loved one said he was last seen near Mud Lake. Now, for those unfamiliar, the lake is located on the outskirts of the Arkansas River at one of the junctions, and it drains into the river itself. Um, police said that authorities had surveyed the lake on boats using sonar technology, and it provides a bird's eye view of the water, and they continued to look for the judge until, you know, visibility made the search impossible and they had to suspend the search. Um, but during the early morning hours on Sunday, the search resumed and uh, they were able to detect the, ju the judge's body with the sonar technology that they had been using. It was indeed found at the bottom of Mud Lake at around 9.15 Sunday morning, according to the sheriff's office. Once the judge's body had been recovered, the deputies confirmed his identity with the help of friends and family. Obviously, the death is currently being investigated, although it's believed to be an accidental drowning. The sheriff's office did note that the body will be sent to the state medical examiner for an official autopsy. Um, you know, my prayers are out there with the family and the friends of Judge Buechner. I really, really can't imagine what they're going through right now. I just hope that his recovery does bring them some sense of closure. Uh, gosh, I mean, this is it's a tough one, guys. So, the, yeah, I mean, it's not every day that, that you find a judge at the bottom of a lake and you know, just send your prayers and your well wishes and your thoughts for this family and the judge's friends and all the constituents in that area that, that know the judge well. Uh, as always, guys, I do thank you for tuning in and watching. I appreciate each and every single one of you being here. Y'all be kind to one another out there, and I'll see you real soon in the next video.